I withdrew $62,000 trading prop firms on XAU USD, and here is how. I have been trading for six plus years now, non stop, 7 a.m. waking up, having a coffee, sitting on my laptop with no distractions until 10 p.m. at night. It has been an ongoing grind. I've been on an absolute mission to get these withdrawals. I knew it could happen. The amount of money I have lost in these years of trading, but finally I'm starting to see reward. This is how. I did it. I like to trade XUSD and I like to catch lower highs to higher entries. This means you see a little breakout on gold, you come pulls back and then you get your entry in. The market direction is key to evaluate. What I mean by this is you need to understand where the market's heading. If it has gone so low bearish where you're thinking this could be a position in the market like a 1950 major level, it could bounce off impulse and go bullish. I would wait for the impulse to happen for it to go up, come back and then catch my entry. Nine times out of 10, this actually works. The way that I've done it now, this week alone, I'm up 10 trades and taken two losses. This isn't my only withdrawal as well. I made a 13k withdrawal, which I haven't made this video yet, but I gave you a little spoiler right here on the screen. 13,000 on a 250k account. Now I take my withdrawal. All of these trades are sent to free trading group. Link is in the description. They're absolutely eating at the moment and I'm getting spammed saying thank you. I don't need to charge for signals, which is why it's free. Because they are free does not mean they are bad. I just wanted to put it out there. If you want me to charge you, I can. No problem. All jokes aside though, with the pair that I am trading gold, it can be very volatile. So you need to keep a tight SL. I use 30 pips at the moment and it's working like a charm. You can have a lower SL that means your risk reward can be higher but you don't want to be tapped out on the markets there was a lot of times over my years of experience trading where i get tapped out and then the trade goes the right way however frustrating this may be you then FOMO in and sometimes it doesn't pay out, which means you are taking further loss and losing more equity on your account. I stopped doing this around two, three years ago now and it's finally starting to show. My initial investment, my first ever payout was 30 thousand dollars now i withdrew sixty-two thousand on gold sales at 1928 entry it wasn't even that many pips it was about 50 60 pips caught cool. but because i'm using a big size account thanks to prop firms my payout was absolutely massive i could never have done this on a live account either a live account i used to try and deposit 500 to a thousand pounds and then flip that into 100k and for some reason it never worked my max flip was 30 grand but i think i just got lucky the way that i've managed to take steps in the right direction is writing a trading plan a trading plan in place and being dialed into it. The problem with a lot of traders is they may not even have a trading plan, but they'll just keep trading, keep FOMOing, keep entering multiple positions, entering into multiple different currency pairs, which makes no sense. You gotta focus on one pair at a time. My main focus has been gold for the last four years now. I know that in that industry, I know that pair inside and out. Two years ago, three years ago, question me on it i will tell you what happened with this being said right now i feel like i'm on a roll sometimes in trading you have to take the highs and you have to take the lows at this moment of time my win streaks have been crazy my profits have been insane and i've got to take full advantage of that i've got to keep making my withdrawals smartly so when i make a withdrawal i don't trade on the account and the profit is there you don't trade there's been too many times in my life where i have made profit on a funded account not withdraw it made like 50k and then got it all the way back down or ended up failing the account and then only get paid out like 50 percent at some firms if this is you when you next get profit on your funded account just buy another challenge delete the account off your phone or computer and go again and wait for that big payout to happen if you are struggling to trade like i said join up the free trading group link is in the description i want everyone to understand where they can become better bad habits lead to success if you can work on them with self-development every single day be focused on your goal you will manage to achieve big things just like myself it isn't luck it is skill but it does take time that initial step forward is the first step you have to make in order to get financial freedom. If you want to sit back and relax and just keep working a nine till five job, then feel free. That's absolutely fine. However, what training has allowed me to do is, is not only 
be financially free. I have massively improved as an individual because of the self-development of my trading. I've learned who I am as a person. I've learned my biggest faults, but also what I'm good at. Over time, I've worked on and progressing both parts of these to form an absolute machine on the markets. And like I said, it's not actually hard to make money in trading. There's going to be everyone watching right now who has made money trading, but they have probably lost more than they have made. And it's not because they are a bad trader, but they have bad individual trades which they need to work on. Thank you all for watching. It's been your boy TJ, and I'll catch you on the next video. Peace.